you. A trip to Tweetsie Railroad is a tradition for a lot of families for Wild West fun. And now that we're in the spooky season, the theme park offers Halloween events and Tweetsie Railroad's haunted ghost train at night. We've got Darkest Night right here beside me, the master of ceremonies, along with Calico Clint, the Tweetsie uh, Railroad cowboy. Welcome you both. Glad you're here. Thank you for having us. Uh, for people who've never visited Tweetsie Railroad in October, um, Darkest, let's let's paint that scene for us. How is the park transformed at night? So by daytime, we have our Wild West family fun. But for Ghost Train, we transform into a spooky Halloween event. Fun for all ages with fun, scares, and all kinds of interesting sights. And Clint, you look like the kind of guy that, that's there in the daytime. Yes, ma'am. Are you there to protect us in the evening? Or is it frightening for kids? Tell us about that element. Yes, ma'am. Uh, during the day, I'm the marshal at Tweetsie Railroad. I mm -hmm. protect the gold. Yeah. And the passengers going around the mountain on engine number 12, our steam locomotive. And uh, you never know what might happen out there during the day. Yeah, during the day, you, you've got that fun. But at night, we're checking out this video now. I mean, kids, families are just thrilled by this stuff. For years, they've been coming to board the locomotive, witness some wild west action during the train ride. But on the haunted ghost train, um, there's a lot of elements of surprise. What, what should we be looking out for, Darkus? So for the ghost train, it's a haunted trip in the darkness around the mountain. You may see some spooky characters along the way. Some people will protect you as you head your trip around the mountain. We suggest our train ride for the braver souls for eight and older. Eight and older. Yes. And, and that's the brave eight-year-olds, too, that's because I, I think a lot of adults are jumping at some of those yes, scenes. Yes, yes. And our haunted house and freaky forest also are for some of the more brave souls. But don't worry. If you're not quite there yet, we have other offerings for our family friendly. The Powell Spooktacular is fun for all ages. And you probably know who you're dealing with sometimes, you know, you're yes. going to take it easy on the little or, exactly. the, or the nervous. Yes. Um, yes. What, let's talk a little bit more about those Halloween events yes. happening throughout the park. You've got trick or treat stations, yes. photo ops, this spooktacular show, mm -hmm. a lot of a lot of events. Exactly. We have we also have the creepy carnival, the black hole and the warp tunnel for all family fun. And we also have uh, dancing and a little Main Street party out there. You'll see myself and some of our spy schools performing various street dances. You could come join along with some street dances and see okay. some performances as well while you wait for your train trip. And then there's going to be people who, who show up for the fudge probably. I uh, mean there's, there's uh, a lot of reasons. No trip to <laughs> Tweetsie is complete without the handmade fudge and candies. Uh, walk us through this offering. A little bit spooky on top but delicious throughout. Yes mm -hmm. ma'am. Uh, during the daytime operations or nighttime during mm -hmm. Ghost Train the fudge shops open. We make all of our fudge in-house at Tweetsie, handmade. Um, it's delicious. We have plenty of variety for little ones or big kids. If I were to sample one, could you fill the next 30 seconds telling us um, about mm -hmm. the tradition? You know, you see families come back year after year. Was it, what is it about Tweetsie? Each of you weigh in mm -hmm. on this, both the daytime and, and the ghost train that, that keep families coming back that make this part of their tradition. I mm -hmm. think it's uh, nostalgia and fun. Mm -hmm. Tweetsie's that place you can go to with your family and just, you know, chill out and have fun. Um, it's the Wild West family fun adventure. I mm -hmm. mean, you can go interact, be a cowboy, you can be a conductor, you can pan for gold, you can do anything you want to do as a kid at Tweetsie. And I think the fact that they're getting on a real train, too. A lot of amusement parks have, have ways, but when you're getting on a real train, this is a real deal thing. This is something kids grow up remembering. Exactly. And the, the same thing for Ghost Train. So as you come in, you know, a lot of our events, they change over the years, but we keep some the same. So it's familiar yet spooky different at the same time okay. for each one. Anything else you would you'd tell people before they make the trip yes. up? Any tips to, to maybe make the most of their experience or what to keep in mind? For the Ghost Train, it is important that you reserve your tickets ahead of time. Mm -hmm. So when you purchase your ticket, the gates will open at 7.30, but your train time is depending on what time you purchase the ticket. There are plenty of things to do in the park while you wait for your Ghost Train time, but <laughs> if you're buying tickets for the Ghost Train, it is very important and very smart to get it early. And, and I've got to guess, are you on the <coughs> Ghost Train standing there addressing us as we ride? What's yes. your role in You will this? find me on Main Street being your master of ceremonies as mm -hmm. people come up. I will give you information on where to go, what to do, help you out through the night. You'll see me dancing. Maybe take a photograph with me as well. And then if we're looking for a smiling, safe face down there, the, we've, we've got cowboys to, to interact with during the day. A lot of options. All right, That's so right. tickets yeah. are in advance um, beforehand. You want to get those so you don't miss out on the spooky fun. Mm -hmm. Any last words before uh, I take another bite of this fudge? And we don't, thank you for being here. Don't forget the tickets for daytime and nighttime mm -hmm. are separate. And you can also order your tickets or get them at the gate. Uh, if you want to order your tickets, get them at Tweetsie.com. Okay, great experience. Thank you so much for being here. We appreciate Thank it. You. Thank you. The park opens at 7.30 p.m. with the first train scheduled for 8 p.m. That's for the haunted ghost train scheduled for 
uh, eight pm is when it goes and then october saturday nights it starts the 14th the park opens at 7 15 with the first train at 7 30 60 for adults 40 for kids it all makes sense with the words on screen children ages 3 to 12 are free or uh, what was the ticket price 40 dollars for them and then children two and under are free a lot of fun to be had